was threatening, so we focused our energy and we made collective efforts towards protecting the environment. All of you get to learn something new today, and I'm hopeful that you're going to take this and teach other young people what you learned here today. You know, yesterday we had over 450 people cleaning the streets of the city of Elizabeth. We started on the steps of City Hall and we went into different locations. Businesses celebrated Earth Day and it was a great success. We picked up the most amount of garbage that we ever did before. So the TV station said to me, what do you hope to learn out of this today? And I said, you know, I don't know what I'm going to learn because it's our generation that only cared about commerce. It's our generation that only cared about economic development and getting ships into the port. So it's your generation that's hopefully going to not only care about the jobs, but also work to revive, estu revive estuaries, bring back wildlife, make the Arthur Kill uh, more acceptable to more recreational activities. So I'm hopeful that all of you can share with your friends and your colleagues that are not here some of the science that you learned, some of the wildlife that you've seen in the Arthur Kill, and hopefully teach others. And those of you that go on to careers about uh, ecological life, you can then come back to this area. Make the estuary work. Make the estuary functioning. Not only for those big ships, but for people who can enjoy the water. So I hope you enjoy the day. Have fun. Ask a lot of questions, because you stay out of school longer if you ask a lot of questions. Our state assembly in the 20th district, Jamel Holly. Let's give it up for your mayor. Mayor Baldwin, city council, board of ed members. But mostly to all of the Elizabeth school students. Give yourselves a round of applause. This is a phenomenal day on it, the councilman touched on it, and I'm going to touch on it real briefly. You are our future. Enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, enjoy being with each other. And we'll see you at Estuary Day in October.